we're doing guys Mick here oh, just finished work it's uh, what half past three in the morning Saturday morning shattered as you can probably imagine <clears throat> oh sorry I'll have a beer I have a few hours of kit oh excuse me I've uh, got one of my all grains here been in the pot of the week. You know what it's like, you can't wait sometimes, can you? So I thought, fuck it, let's oop, so I thought, sod it, let's crack it open. Let's see what we got. We have a bit of carbonation. I have had a beer already, but that was a uh, hobgoblin. Look at that beauty. And it used to stay in the bottom. I mean, one thing at like that was a bitter, but it is. Definitely is. Good carbonation there, though. Nice head retention. Got at least a two finger. First ever proper go at an all green. Proper go, I mean, not like the first one where it was just, well, it was just a disaster. Mmm, smell it, smell it. Oh man, that is nice. I can't remember what hops are in this. This is the Idle Valley English Bitter Kit. I'll tell you what. I'm glad I bought another one. I can't wait to see what the stout one's going to be like. That was it bursting with flavour. Okay, it's warm because it's not really in the fridge. Definitely getting the malt. Not so much the uh, aroma of the hops or anything. Excuse me. Probably a little bit too carbonated for a bitter. But I tell you what, there's a big difference between these and the kits. And it's smooth, very smooth to drink. Oh yeah, too smooth. This is from the Idle Valley Brewing Company. Uh, Harry Brew 69, Harry Hawks. And I tell you what, for my first proper all grain, I am well impressed. Head is going to get all the way down that. All the way down. And the carbonation. Tastes good. It is good. So, next thing is to do the uh, the stout, the Idle Valley stout, and uh, see how that goes and get that bottled up, kegged up, bottled up for Christmas. Um, oh, almost here. Yes, very impressed. What do I do now? Let's cut down the brew time. I think I did it for just over four hours last. I think this last time. So uh, see how it goes, isn't it? I've uh, got the Cooper's Euro Lager to uh, keg tomorrow. That's with the rhubarb. Rhub. 
Barb. And I've also got the turbo cider with the plums in to do tomorrow as well. Oh, I don't think I've got a few more days in it yet. But we shall see. I'm going back to play on my Xbox now. Destiny awaits. Cheers, guys.